Copel State Park. It is January 7th, 2023, 12.03 p.m. Today we're going to do a quick little hike to the... Uh, we're going to do the Fossil Boulder to Fossil Boulder, the Twin Fossil Boulder hike. We started a Fossil Boulder that looks very similar to the uh, end Fossil Boulder. The first Fossil Boulder is down at the end of Cucumber Run, which is right over the railing over there. And Cucumber Run ends up at the... Uh, uh, Yakagani River, right at the Yakagani River is where the uh, first fossil boulder is that starts the hike. And then at the uh, end of the hike will be at the Cucumber Rapids. Boulder Field Pinch Point. This is Cucumber Falls. river is at 4.6 feet today so that'll be the uh, the bar to measure you know, all of the cool stuff against how high the river is These two fossil boulders are kind of interesting. They're kind of almost very similar. I should probably bring a measuring tape and measure them even. They're almost, I didn't even notice. I've been hiking here for six years and I didn't even notice that they were so similar in size and height. The first fossil boulder, the, the fossils are way 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 more deteriorated but you can still see that they're the same kind of plant fossils and then the second fossil boulder is really the cool one has like the real distinctive debris of the actual fossilized plant matter And this happened about two to three weeks ago. This big tree fell on, smashed the trail. Okay, Main Falls, or sorry, Cucumber Falls. And this Cucumber Run stretch from Main Fall, uh, from Cucumber Falls down to the Yakagani River. Really a beautiful place to hike in the summer. Like a kid's playground. You really would wish your parents would have brought you here when you were a kid so you could hop around these rocks.
by the sound of the river or the cucumber run here I think it's going to be a little bit too high for me to cross in my rubber boots even when the water's a little lower I'll cross here and continue the short hike along the river shore down to the cucumber rapids which are right out there in the river the Akigani River Ohio State Park they're coming up to where cucumber run comes into the Yakigani River yes oh me I think I can get across maybe we'll see I got about I got about 14 inches on my boots All right, Yakagini River. I think it's about 34 degrees out right now. Okay, so they're across this little stream here. There are a bunch of boulders. And one of these boulders is remarkably similar to the boulder, which is down at the boulder field down there. So we're going to use those two boulders as the start and the end of our hike today. Looks like we can we can get across up there. This could be a big bust though. If I slip or if I get water in my boots, I'm going to quit. How am I going to get across? If it were more warm, I think I'd just risk it, not worry about it. But because it's too cold, I would get my foot completely wet and that'd be miserable the rest of the day. These rocks over here are a little just too slippery to step on. So I don't even think about using them. Oh, not too bad. Hey, maybe can make it. Give it a shot here.
Oh, that worked good. All right, so. They were not too slippery after all. We usually just give up on those rocks. They're just too slippery, but not too bad. All right, so the start of our hike now. That's the Cucumber Run. And it's coming down from Cucumber Falls to here. And this is the Yakagini River. Upstream is Main Falls. Downstream, upstream is also Entrance Rapids. Those rapids over there are Entrance Rapids. Another one of my favorite areas right over there. Entrance Rapids has some incredible uh, potholes.